everyone, welcome back to part two of week two of the nicest apocalypse ever. When we last left off, we were waiting for Thursday to roll around so Lena could uh, hopefully lift the, reach the top of the culinary career track and lift the culinary restrictions. Um, but she just rolled a want for, to woohoo with Ambrose. Um, in order to fulfill that want, we would need to have her try for baby. Uh, because birth control is restricted until we lift the medical, someone tops the medical career. And I think we're just going to go for it. And uh, we're going to get right to business while the car is downstairs beeping the horn. Let's make a baby. We'll be waiting for the charms to see if uh, they start playing. I'm guessing no baby. Okay, uh, let's have Ambrose go to work. And, and Lena is not allowed to sleep in the bed until she gets a 10 body skill. She can only sleep in uh, low energy beds, and this one isn't one. Uh, so unfortunately, <laughs> unfortunately for uh, Lena, no, uh, no beds for you. I'm gonna have her come down here, and we'll have her. Oh, she wants to get a cleaning skill. Um, do we want to have her fulfill that? I guess we do, don't we? Is there anything for her to clean? I would kind of rather wor her work on body. Uh, but it is what it is. Okay, I'm going to, there was no charm, so Lena did not get pregnant, but we'll try again. Um, and I'll bring you back when uh, something interesting yeah. happens. Lena just got another body skill point, and Ambrose, with the level 10 cooking, managed to, uh, to burn these hot dogs. <laughs> Um, and I brought you back because I, I remembered that I put in a couple more mods. I put in a uh, the Simply Leftover mod, which allows you to put uh, put away leftovers as single plates. Um, <laughs> And this is the only meal that they're allowed to make, so I can't have them. Uh, usually I wouldn't let my Sims eat burnt food, but she's hungry, so uh, yeah. And I also put in, besides the Simply Leftover mod, I put in uh, the No Eat Crap mod, uh, which just means that they'll stop eating once they're full. And um, I think they're going to try for baby again. Well... Does she have any wants? Yeah, I think we're gonna have, uh... We'll let, uh, Lena finish eating. And then we'll have her dance with, uh, Ambrose. You know. Because we want to make sure that we, uh, keep filling her aspiration. Now with the aspiration, uh, meter, basically, the higher that is, um, your sims will do what you ask them to. So, uh, yeah. Let's see if we can't get her the want to uh, woohoo again, but it looks like not. Uh, but we'll keep going this way. Gossip, appreciate, back rub. <laughs> Flirt. I don't know. Goose. Uh, so far, it's been really easy to keep her aspiration up. She keeps rolling wants that I can fulfill. 
I don't know that I've ever had two family sims for the apocalypse. But I remember it being harder than this. But I think I might have had fortune sims. There we go. Oh. <laughs> oh, she stinks. <laughs> she stinks and like Ambrose is like 10 meat. He must hate this. Well, maybe not that much. <laughs> Ambrose is like, I'll put up with a lot for a baby. Let's see if we get the woohoo want. Yay! Yay, we did! Okay, uh, let's uh, get back to uh, business here. You relax. You relax, too. <laughs> and, uh, and let's try for baby again with the stink cloud. <laughs> I think it's pheromones. It'll be, uh, it'll be good. I've never had a sim uh, teleport all over the place like I've been having Ambrose doing. It's been, uh, really nice. Let's see. Does he have... Will he, like, be disgusted by her? <laughs> uh, let's, uh, let's try for baby and get this over with. Do you know what? We got a cutscene last time. I guess we, I've never had them uh, woohoo in bed before. Okay, and we have to kick her. She wants to reach cleaning skill. Uh, we need to kick her out of bed. I'm sorry, you can't sleep. We'll leave Ambrose sleeping, though. Let's, um, let's come... And we'll have her come here and stand next to the sink, and maybe she'll uh, take the hint and uh, wash up a little bit. And uh, no charms, so they still didn't get pregnant. I know, you stink. <laughs> Ew. Ew, he's right. But I guess uh, she has her priorities straight. She's going to eat first. <laughs> Now she wants to reach cleaning level 7. Why, I'm not sure, but uh, we'll let her do it. Oh, you know what? I think she needs that for education anyway, so that's good. I don't mind. <laughs> burnt food. I get, this thing cloud just magically went away? Oh no, she left it behind her. Now, the jumbok might help this a little bit. There we go. She's going to take a sponge bath now. No, I guess not. She just does not want to be clean. Go stand there. There we go. Okay, with that uh, apocalyptic scene, I'll bring you guys back when uh, it's time for her to uh, go to work. And we're trying for baby one more time. The fireworks have gone off, and now we're just listening for the chimes. And there we go! Lena's gonna have a baby! Very good. Very good. Uh... And it is uh, Thursday morning. We are going to top up Lena's needs as best we can. Um, and Ambrose is going to continue looking, take out all of the newspapers and look for a job in uh, the natural sciences career track. And uh, yeah, I'll bring you back in a bit. We are back and I have to say, I thought we... We had it pretty easy because we had uh, six newspapers, but yeah, this is like uh, two days now where I've gone through all six papers and we still haven't um, gotten the careers that we're looking for. Uh, so yeah, this is no guarantee. <laughs> 
And Lena, in lieu of sleep, she's been uh, Tai chi -ing. And uh, so her body skill is uh, going up nicely. She has five points now, six, uh, which is good. And we're on our last paper, and we're looking for natural science or education. And yeah, no, none of them came up. Two days now, six papers. And I'm not sure what I'm doing with uh, Ambrose here. I guess we'll uh, just have him uh, go wash his hands a bit. Oh, he can clean. Wash his hands. Ooh, we'll get all of their newspapers uh, back in their inventory. Ooh. And Lena's in pretty good condition. We'll have her um, wash her hands. She can eat at work today, tonight. And her, because she still has vacation benefits, um, she's maxed out for job performance. So unless she gets fired, uh, she's definitely going to max her career tonight. So I'll bring you, she's going to work at uh, 2 p.m. in a couple hours. And I'll bring you guys back when, uh, when she's on her way home. Okay, Lena should be coming home in a few minutes. Uh, she went to work. She's tired. She needs to use the bathroom. And she stinks. Uh, but she's not hungry, so which, that is good. Uh, Ambrose uh, came home from work. We had him uh, pay the bills, and I'm just having him take a nap. And here we go. Celebrity Chef. So the culinary restrictions are lifted, which means that we can uh, we can buy appliances. We can we can store leftovers. Uh, we can feed pets. Uh, all of that good stuff. We can store food in our inventories if we have the room. Uh, so this is a, a pretty nice one. I never lift, I've never lifted culinary so easily, uh, so early, just because it's not, um, it's not something that's really that much of an issue. Uh, everybody needs to work. They can eat at work. They can uh, have the one meal a day. Um, but because we did um, lift culinary, it means that we can buy appliances now. And since we can buy appliances, uh, we can make a uh, cheesecake. So we are going to, we are going to buy an oven and, uh, and make some cheesecake. Uh, for those who, of you who don't play The Sims, uh, if a pregnant Sim eats cheesecake, um, they'll have twins. <laughs> and if you have twins, that's two people that can uh, lift careers instead of one. Uh, so we're going to wake up Ambrose and have him make some cheesecake for, for Lena. Serve dessert. Cheesecake. And... Lena, we are going to uh, have her wash her hands and maybe she'll take a sponge bath for us. You know, all the apocalyptic stuff. Oh, you're tired? No. Well, I guess, I guess take a nap. Now this is going to be um, this is going to be interesting. If she has a if she has a hard pregnancy, <laughs> um, I can't have her sleep in a comfortable bed. Um, so this this should be interesting. I think I'm going to have Ambrose uh, cook up a bunch of uh, of fish and store them as leftovers as well. So that way, if she's uh, crazy hungry, uh, she can have a filling meal. There we go. Um, you don't need to serve that. And Lena, I know you're not hungry, but uh, but come get some. Uh, come get.
get some food anyway. Here we go. Uh, I put in, I said I put in that mod. We're going to put away leftovers and it just gives you an option of putting it away as single plates, uh, which is really nice. It's, it's a time saver. And we'll have, uh, we'll have Lena come eat some cheesecake here. And we'll have Ambrose answer. There we go. Lena is going to have twins. Mm -hmm. And I also put in that mod that... No, no, don't clean that up. Oh, no. Oh, that was perfectly good food. Um, let's, let's have Lena do perform Tai Chi. Because she's not going to be able to sleep while he's on the phone anyway, so. If we can get her to ten body, she'll, uh, she can sleep in the bed. And, do we want this dog? No. Because we can't bathe it. But I do want to lift pet restrictions. This is tough. But we can feed it. We just can't wash it. No, I'm not going to do that. I had one apocalypse where I had um, a dog before I lifted medical. And it stunk so bad. And nobody would play with it. And they just... It was awful. I felt so bad for that dog. We're not doing it. It's not going to happen. Let's get... Let's cook some fish instead. How am I going to do this juggling act here? Well, I guess we'll uh, put Ambrose's uh, newspapers up here. And we'll put some fish in his inventory. Um, let's move the, we'll move the stove over here temporarily. I'll be so, so happy when, uh, when the restrictions on their inventory is done. And make money, many group meals, uh, black and catfish. Decent. This is a fascinating stuff, right? Hopefully this episode will be a lot shorter than last one. I have no idea what you guys... I mean... If you're watching, I don't know if you want to see this stuff or if you would just prefer like a real quick recap. But regardless of what you'd prefer, uh, I'm not a good storyteller here. <laughs> I know what I should... Oh, how stupid is that? No, what are you... Oh, okay, it went in his inventory. That's fine. Good job. Sorry I doubted you. Oh, and there we go. The baby! <laughs> Yeah, sorry about that. Come run here and, uh... And maybe you'll wash... Wash your hands. I know you stink. Everybody knows you stink. It'll be interesting to see how her needs are taken care of. Because, uh... Yeah. Well, let's see what she does. I know. What is this? Oh, maybe she's going to get a baby bump? We don't have enough. Oh, okay. Um, make... Grill... Bass with squash. Mm -hmm. 
Oh, I am so sorry, Lena. You cannot, you cannot sleep in the bed. If it gets really bad, I'll have to buy, um, she can only sleep in a bed with energy level three. So if it gets really bad, I'll have to, uh, I'll buy another bed. But I'm trying not to add, like, look, you can already see just from a couple days of just uh, living. Uh, no, don't serve. Nobody's hungry. I want you to uh, put away leftovers and... And put away leftovers as single plates. And now at least she'll have um, a lots of filling food that uh, she can just go to the refrigerator and grab. And let's get the other, the other food out of his inventory and have him put that away as well. Single plates, put away leftovers, single plates, and it's two o'clock, so we'll have him do the job thing as well. Uh, I'm not gonna have you guys sit through this. If, if any of the careers that I wanna give them pop up, I will uh, bring you back and let you know. Um, with Celebrity Chef, she has off Friday, Saturday, Sunday, and Monday, so uh, she has plenty of time to have the baby and go back to work if need be. Uh, yeah, but I'll see you uh, in a little bit if they get a good job. Okay, guess what came up? Natural Scientist. Um, this was the third uh, job in the paper, and Ambrose shouldn't be allowed to take this because until, uh, I don't know, one of the restrictions I want to say journalism is lifted the the rule is that you can only take the first job in the newspaper unless it was one of your majors and natural scientists wasn't um, that said I do not care um, we showed on the first episode that if I wanted to I could put this newspaper in his inventory have him pull it out again keep checking it and the careers will rotate I am not bothering to do that I'm just making up I'm modifying the rules <laughs> um, so we're just gonna have him uh, take this job and I think Lena is about to get her first baby bump Aww. with the little one on the way uh, Lena's been placed on maternity leave um, but she has the next four days off anyway so it doesn't matter I know why don't you take a shower, Lena? I guess not. And Ambrose is home from work. And now he is a scat master, which is amazing, right? <laughs> Let's see if we can send him back to work. 11 to 6. He can go right back to work to get another, another promotion. We want to get him to the top of this career as quick as possible. I have no idea what level Scat Master is, but I'm assuming it's pretty low. <laughs> and Ambrose is home, hopefully with another promotion. Uh, yes, nine to four, so he cannot get another promotion. So that is it for the day. He's now a soil identifier. That's a uh, that's pretty nice, right? Sure it is. Okay, here's something interesting. I just realized that I messed up the recording again. <laughs> uh, so I have no idea. You guys have probably seen all of the parts that I was trying to fast forward through and uh, none of the parts I was trying to show you. But just for a quick recap, Ambrose and Lena got married on the sidewalk and uh, Lena, we are having a tough time balancing her needs, but we're managing. Uh, so just in case I really messed up the recording, that's what's been going on, and now I'll bring you back again later. And it looks like Lena is going to get her... Yeah. <laughs> 
Oh, how lovely. I know, I know. <laughs> she is having such a hard time of it. I know, it would make it so much easier if... If she could just sleep and uh, gain her energy back a little faster, but it is what it is. Um, Lena just woke up. She's in a bladder desperation, and I think she is about to give birth. <laughs> Ambrose is at work. The phone is ringing. Oh, poor Lena. There's two new babies. Oh my god, I didn't give... I didn't think of names. Um, shoot. Names, names, names. Oh, babies. Oh. Put that one down. And another one. Don't we get to name them? So we have a baby boy and a baby girl. Um, I thought I was going to do, like, since Ambrose is starts with an A, I thought I was going to do B and C, you know, like alphabetical names. Um, but I don't know names. Uh, Booker. Book, um, let's do Booker. Booker. <laughs> Uh, Booker and Case, Casey, Booker, and the girl will be Casey. <laughs> Booker and Casey, welcome to the family. Okay, so we have, uh, two babies. Booker, Booker on the floor, and Casey, I guess Booker is going to be our heir. Um, let's see if we can get Lena to use the bathroom. And today is Sunday, so I think we're going to go ahead and, uh, d deluxe the, deduct, dag me. The life of crime payment, which is now 300 simoleons from their family funds. Uh, which worked. We have two new babies. Um, Booker and Casey. Ambrose is at work trying to uh, become a some kind of natural scientist who only works on Wednesdays. Lena, we have given up I gave up trying to find her a job in education just because uh, her needs have been so hard to keep up. Um, but that is going to be the end of this episode. Thank you so much for watching, and I hope you'll come back for uh, week three when we sort out the babies and, uh, and see if we can get this family back on track. Thank you. Bye-bye.